That boyfriend is significant because he is the last person to hear from Molly before she disappeared. New this morning, we are also learning of a possible Molly sighting late last week in Missouri, giving the family hope that she's still alive. She's sweet, kind, extremely lovable. It's really hard not to like her. 20 year old Dalton Jack describing Molly Tibbetts, his girlfriend of three years who vanished without a trace more than two weeks ago. Initially it was shock and then, you know, it gets harder day by day because she's still not here and, you know, you miss her, you miss her more than anything in the world. Overnight, hundreds gathered at a vigil for the missing University of Iowa student last seen on her nightly jog in the small town of Brooklyn. Molly's family believes she returned to the house Jack shares with his brother and used the computer, but investigators remain tight-lipped on the timeline of her disappearance. Do you believe she disappeared on the run or after she returned home? Well, I mean, that's one of those details that, that I'm, I'm not going to discuss today. Overnight, NBC News confirming police responded to a possible sighting of Molly at this truck stop in western Missouri late last week. It remains unclear if it resulted in any leads. As the tireless search for Molly intensifies, investigators hope data from her Fitbit may provide clues to her whereabouts. We are looking at all technology as it relates to Molly, um, and we are looking to generate leads based on that technology. Investigators do not consider Molly's boyfriend Jack a suspect. He was working a construction job 100 miles away in Dubuque. Jack says he hasn't heard from Molly since that night when she sent him a Snapchat message. I opened it at about 1030, and then I promptly fell asleep. Jack now holding out hope for her safe return. You know, the only thing that comes into your head whenever you're, you know, not an investigator, you don't have all the facts, is that something bad happened and you don't, I personally don't want to believe that, you know, even if that might be the reality, I don't want to think about that. And Blake, there is another news conference scheduled. Anything you're expecting to hear from officials? Well, I'm told we can expect to hear from Molly's mother today at that news conference later this morning. She'll issue a brief statement and a source with Crime Stoppers of Central Iowa says the big news to come out of that press conference later today will be a massive jump in the reward. They're still tallying up the final number, but they say the reward, the new reward will be at least $148,000, a staggering number up from just $2,000 a few days ago. Mm -hmm. Guys. All right, Blake, we'll hope that money helps. Thanks. Yes, absolutely. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.